Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Slava, good to see everybody and welcome the guests of my channel as well. If you're new, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. All right, my wonderful collectives, let's do another reading for you. What messages do I have for you? And what, what is going to be changing after this eclipse? What is going to change and what do you need to know? Well, things are changing for you. That's without doubt. We have changes. Nine. Nine is not a ten. Ten usually is the ending, but there is a definitely change. So this is, could be an ending of some sort of situation. Um, so let's, let's uplift. Let's see what is changing. What is going to change? What is going to change? I have three of cups. I have six of cups. I have ten of pentacles. Those are very amazing, amazing cards here. And I also have ten of cups. I have a lot of emotions. A lot of emotions, a lot of fulfillment, a lot of peace, celebration, happiness, fulfillment. So maybe right now um, you feel a little heavy, right? Because clearly this is something that is yet to come towards you. This financial stability, both financial and, and, and personal life. So it represents overall happiness. But let's see where you're at right now. If this is, is changing, if this is a coming, let's see where you're at right now. Where are you at right now? Ace of Wands. You already made some changes. You made some changes in your life. You had to either stand your grounds. I also have Eight of Swords. It's a breakthrough in your situation. I feel like you were restricted for a very long time. You couldn't move. You could have, you, you could have not allowed yourself to feel happy. There is someone or something intentionally prevented you from feeling free. Because with Three of Cups, it's all about freedom. It's about happiness. It's about joy, where you want to sink, where you want to laugh, where you just want to be free. So this is a changing. What will change after this eclipse is that you finally will feel free. You will become a step closer to your wish fulfillment. And this is in particular to obtaining happy family or even a home or purchasing a home, buying a home. So there's going to be a breakthrough in your situation, situation that you have been dealing with for a very long time. You feel restrained, restricted. Asa wants it's a breakthrough. You're going to make changes in regards of this stagnation. And that changes that you're going to make here after this eclipse, it will bring you towards that happiness. Because enough is enough. I feel like your cup of patience is already outfloated. It's burst. You can no longer be silent. You can no longer be patient. You have had enough. You have had enough. So let's take a look here. What is this Ace of Sword, um, Eight of Swords situation? Breakthrough because of why? What is this breakthrough? Poverty. Okay. Messages. Man, female. Thoughts. Great fortune. Well, that's exactly you, right? Messages. Great fortune. You. You have had enough. You have had enough of being in this position. So there's going to be a message. There's going to be, like I said, a breakthrough that is coming towards you. What is this message in regards of? What is this message in regards that you're going to receive? That message that you will receive will be um, very valuable to you. This message could be could came could come from a female, okay, female. 
For example, you uh, went out with your friends and you just heard this interesting phrase and you're like, hmm, oh, that's interesting. Oh, that makes sense. So I feel like there's going to be something said either verbally to you or through text message or you could read it up on the internet or in particularly a female will come in and tell you something and you will think on it and you're like, wow, I never thought of that. So you will apply this information, you will obtain this information that will once again will free you and bring you towards that fortune and that happiness and celebration. But let's see, what is this message in regards? So if you're receiving new evidence, new information about some sort of false person, some crooks or fakes, there's some information coming towards you unexpectedly. You're like, Wow, hmm, interesting. I never thought of that, but yeah, that made me think. So that information that you will receive about some sort of fake people could be couple, could be a whole organization, and that information will put you in a deep thought. You will start painting the picture and putting, it's like you building up the puzzle. You're putting the dots together, and you're like, oh, okay, so that makes sense. And you're like, bam, bingo, I got the answer. I know how to get myself out of these restrictions. I know now how to outsmart these fakes, these crooks. So there is some sort of very powerful information that is coming towards you, okay, that you will utilize. And that information that you will receive, whether it is, like I said, it shows me female, mature female, main female from a female, uh, whatever that female could be to you. Oh, this is, could be an information in regards of a female that is a fake female. And that information will lead you towards victory, towards celebration. Right? So the, expect huge breakthrough. <clears throat> okay. Wow. Quite of channeling going on here. Okay, so what is this fake person? Is that a female? So you're not going to be, like I said, in this position of this Eight of Swords for a long time. So hang in there. Changes are coming towards you. There will be celebration and party on your street, in your home, in your life. There's a great fortune towards you. I also feel like these fakes, these crooks that you've been dealing with did everything they could for you to remain in poverty. Now, poverty not necessarily mean financial poverty. This is could could represent where you will not where you, this is means where you were not credited for what you worth. You were discredited, um, belittled, disrespected by this fake person, or could be a couple. But it's showing me a female here. Okay, so there's going to be a breakthrough in your case. Now, um, what are these fakes here? Let's see. What are these fakes? What are these fakes? <clears throat> Deadline. See? We also have here sunset. TikTok. Time is running out. Time is running now. These individuals can no longer, like I said, hide away. What are they hiding? What is this female in particularly hiding? Running out time, running out deadline. Chain down. She can no longer, like I said, control the situation. And we have court, court paperwork filed, legal. Law, law involves some information potentially through paperwork. Where you find out that this individual intentionally tried uh, to ch chain you down. This is could, could mean that <laughs> put you in jail. This is could mean corruption on paperwork. This is could mean anything to do where law was utilized against you. This is could represent a Wilson estate matter. In regards of inheritance, this is could represent custody. This is could represent a criminal law. Could represent anything, but I feel like legally this fakes can no longer keep you down and keep you chained. 
Time is running out. Time is running out. Let's uh, let's take a look more here. I have ham hamster wheel. These people are paying out a lot of uh, other people. This is corruption here. Paying out to extend the time, but I feel like time is not going to be um, extended any longer. They can no longer keep you anchored, keep you chained. They have no authority. See, they there was only so much time that was given to these crooks in order to entrap you. Or maybe the masculine to entrap you. Was this female showing me some sort of twin flame? Also has a part of this, the one that you cut off. But I feel like they're out of timeline, okay? They run out of the time. They have, they have nothing. There's nothing, okay? So you will find out about this situation. You will find out the truth about this female. Um, and some sort of masculine they showed me as well. That, that, that you were trying to, to be entrapped. That something that was done against you that was unlawfully. And these are highly toxic individuals. Highly fakes. Okay, well, my question is, why would this individual, this fake female, because it's showing me some sort of fake female and some sort of masculine in the back, why would this corrupt couple, let's call it that, or partners, whatever they are, um, try to entrap you? What What is the reason? What is the reason? That these individuals try to do this to you. Give me the answer. The reason. Five of cups. These individuals want you to lose everything. Want you to be in grief. They want you to suffer. They're just toxic people. Ace of Swords, Ace of Swords, Three of Pentacles. They utilize a lot of people. A lot of lies have been spread about you. This is where part of the entrapment. The part of the entrapment that whoever this sociopathic female is was another masculine. They did the best they could to ensure that you are alone, that you are cut off, cut off from the community, cut off from a society. They didn't want anybody to help you. They wanted you to cut off completely from your friends, from everything, everything. You have no idea the tremendous bullshit that this idiotic couple, they showed me some sort of burgundy cherry headed haired bitch over here and some macho wannabe, okay? And they did as much as they could to cut you off so of the communities, so of your family, so of your co-workers, so of your friends, seeing you from this fucked up light and had this idea of you as if you are nobody. The point was to show the community and the society whom you trusted at one point that you are nothing. And it was lies. It was lies upon of lies upon of lies. So my question is, if these idiots spread so much lies, involved third party, why? Why so much hatred? Why so much hate, jealousy, and envy towards you? <clears throat> Stress burdens at the breaking point, unable to cope or face life, mental anguish, guilt, regret, terror, fear, negativity. They're just negative people. They're negative people. What else? Why? Because they felt trapped. They felt trapped so they wanted you to feel trapped. They did not they were resisting change. They were trying to avoid strategy or they are trying right now to avoid strategy. They have some, I have also some sort of marriage cup here and I have a love. This is, could be partnership and unity. The this female potentially could have not bared the fact uh, that they're not the one. Maybe, maybe they wanted to be the one. They blamed you. This is like I said, some sort of 
twin flame relationship connected thing. Some family and unity and partnership. This, is, this female resisted this change. Had a lot of fear, had a lot of stress, was not happy. So because this individual was not happy, this is, could be a couple of them. She wanted to brought this unhappiness to in your life so you don't feel happy because that individual could have not let go. Could have not let go. Let go of who? So this is overall a romantic. This is all revenge because of relationship, a third party. Or what is this about? Because they're showing me some sort of family and they're showing me... Um, Unity, partnership, couple, soulmates, attraction, connection. And I feel like a female here could have not deal and deal to see what you seeing being happy. So they had to illuminate you. Female had to illuminate you. It's a sick, twisted revenge. So is this is a romantic partnership? Is this is was about the romantic partnership? Queen of Pentacles comes up in here, strategized, strategized some sort of female here. She come up with the strategy to build this happy family. We once again, uh, confirmation, we have 10 of cups twice here. Wanted to have stability, wanted to have home. It sounds to me like a third party. I'm sorry to say that, but it does. It sounds to me like some sort of very jealous sociopathic individual that come up with a strategy that she's going to destroy your life. Cause you problems with the law. We've seen that. File a bunch of bullshit false police reports against you. It was all planned. It was all planned. She didn't do it herself. With Three of Pentacles, she bullshitted about you to a lot of people. To a whole freaking community. And this was to, to have a strategy for life, for, for family. So as this was some sort of relationship, show me the masculine here. Yeah, this card flow. Revenge. Revenge to cut you off quickly. It was the matter of time. She needed to do it quickly. Quickly. See, justice card come up here. So this idiot over here, well, she's not quite an idiot. Um, whoever believed her is an idiot. She's a, just a simple sociopath. But anyways, uh, she came up with this strategy to cause you judicial problems. Because it's, it's showing me the matter of time. Very quick. Knight of Swords is about speed. It's about events that have to be taken really quickly. She might have strategized it for like six months. Before it happened. But I feel like there was a time factor. Okay. The time factor. I have to do it now. Or I'm going to miss out my opportunity to be happy. I have to break up you, my collectives and some other person that is not showing so I feel like it was it was done really, really quickly. Really quickly and in secret. In secret. And it does show me the third party here. Queen of Swords also shows up here. Some other female she used. So she didn't do it herself. She might have had connection with somebody in the judicial system. A friend, potentially. Somebody here. But this is most likely a third party. A third party, and this is to do with the king of uh, king of ones, masculine. Okay. Jealousy. This is all it is. Jealousy. Jealousy. Why? Because you're brighter. You're smarter. You're incredible. You're one of a kind. You're unique. Losers. Losers that simply could have not bear the fact that you are happy. That you are happy. So know that there's going to be a breakthrough. You will soon find out every single thing that this lunatics did. They're showing me in particular here two females and one male. Okay. Definitely a cherry-headed one um, has a place to be here. Blonde or cherry-headed. So um, as you can see, it was revenge. Tell me more about the situation briefly. Interview. Divine Masculine. Oh yeah, they were interrogated, this Divine Masculine. 
lockdown, mental prison, confinement. It's coming out to light. It's coming out all to light. Masculine is also here um, involved. <clears throat> they set you up. Whatever reason they fucking set you up, it doesn't fucking matter anymore, does it? The only thing that matter here is you deserve to feel free and happy without these losers running away from their actions. There has to be a consequences for their actions. That's the problem. So once again, this is all coming out. This is all coming out. These individuals are going to be locked up, mental prison confinement. They do, masculine potentially could have been already interviewed by the police or will be interviewed by the police in regards his involvement in what have happened. And of course, these other um, psychopathic females, they also going to catch up as well. So at the end of the day, what you should expect is the fact that this situation is going to come to light. What these trios have done to you, to what extent these lunatics have taken to destroy your life. And it was all about to separate your relationship. These individuals did not want to accept the fact <clears throat> that potentially you and your ex were together. They, they wanted to separate you. And that sick paranoia, um, unhappiness, this anguish, hatred and jealousy towards you um, caused you a lot of restrictions that you did not deserve. So you, this is coming to light. The involvement of all these third parties in your life. Toxic. Whatever they filed here, they will be held accountable. They entrap you legally. That's what they did. They entrap you legally. So this is the first event and the first thing that is going to take place. After eclipse is a breakthrough in your situation. What else? What else is going to change? What else is going to change? Self-confidence throughout God confidence. Believe in yourself by believing in God working through you. Third eye. Oh, sorry, tiger eye. Tiger eye. <clears throat> Excuse me. <laughs> so once again, self-confidence. You, you will truly feel proud of yourself. You will feel confident. You will feel confident because you withstand the most sickest, the most cruelest, the most degrading treatment you could have ever possibly faced because of these selfish lunatics that uh, did all this for what? Out of jealousy? Out of revenge? So your confidence coming back. Your confidence, you will, like I said, you will allow yourself to be happy. Happiness, this is what's changing. Major changes is not only the fact that you will be <clears throat> free, from these chains that was intentionally entrapped against you by jealous bitches. But you will also going to feel happy. This is good means that you will find your other half as well. Build a family. Find someone. Let's clarify it here. Two of ones. <clears throat> and we have Hierophant. We have Victory. You're making a right choice. You're making a choice to once again trust God and trust the divine in your life. Three of Pentacles. Cooperation with other people. And once again, we have King of Pentacles coming up here. And we have Six of Cups. So there could be a new person. New person that is coming towards you that is God sent. New relationship. New partner. New partner is there for you. Tower. Knight of Pentacles. Nine of Swords. Well, <clears throat> your enemies are thinking right now. They're thinking about um, how to destroy your life. Okay, they potentially have been trying to strategize for a very long time, but they don't know how to do it. So you don't need to be concerned or worried about your enemies, and particularly that I just um, discussed about. Uh, because at the end of the day, you're still moving 
You're still moving towards stability. We have strengths card. We have your strengths, your powerful positions, your protection. These people from your past they that are involved were involved in your life. Believe me, they tried everything to destroy your life. All possible scenarios and all possible actions they could have utilized. But they could have not. So this month, after this eclipse, you will truly feel the support. I feel like there is a support that is coming towards you. You will feel supported. We have a beautiful strengths card, a beautiful person, a female here, and a lion. Very powerful lion. You will be supported by the individual you can trust. So you're not alone. God sending you an individual that once again with three of pentacles will counsel on your behalf. That will be your good advisor, will be your good supporter. That will support you. And that's exactly why these lunatic enemies are going to face destructions in life. Tell me more about this person. Vacation, hideaway, adventure. Cleansing, see? Maybe you, you will travel with this person. Maybe you'll go on vacation. There's going to be this individual... Um, is, is is going to come in into your life to make you truly happy. I feel like whatever these lunatics have done in the past, all this jealousy is finally, like I said, removed. All the negativity is removed out of your life. You now cleared your heart for this new connection that is coming towards you. And this is a beautiful thing, right? This is the thing. When you're ready to allow somebody to love you and you will love them back, you're not afraid. Your heart is healed and i feel like in this uh month of april because i'm looking right now at the events after the eclipse i feel like you're going to allow yourself to love again your heart is no longer burdened by some losers this all what is coming towards you is nothing but happiness and joy And it's going to be in the face of some masculine here. If for masculine, that's a female. Now let's take a look about these enemies. Whatever they're planning, puffing, huffing, like I said. Because they know they're running out of time. Stressing out. Cannot sleep at night. Hiding in the middle of a night. Sinking. The outcome for these enemies of yours. Conflicts, conflicts, arguments, problems, drama, blaming each other, defending their grounds, problems just beginning, ten of pentacles, this whole community will be left with nothing, five of pentacles will be left with nothing, they can puff and huff until, you know what, let's take a look at this connection, what is this connection, what is this new relationship, because the, the strong message I receive here is not only you redeeming your innocence, but I also get an, uh, an energy of true love. What is this about? Knight of Swords. Queen of Wands. Two of Cups. See? Love. Love. You're choosing your relationship. You said, fuck the past. That's why the past is going to be nothing but sorrow, three of swords, I, I promise you. The moment you let go, karma already receives your message. Universe receives your message the moment you release it. So you no longer have anybody in your heart because you let go of these toxic relationships. Right? Your heart has been cleared. This is exactly what this cleansing means. is meaning that you have cleared your heart from all the toxic and negative experiences and situations that you have lived through in your past. Because you did so, you cleared all this negativity of the broken heart. Look what's happening towards with you. Two of Cups. Soulmate. A new person. 
And on top of that, you as a queen of wands, you're very, you're on fire. You're going to protect and defend your grounds. You're going to protect your heart. You're not going to let anybody to fuck you over ever again, to hurt you ever again, because you'll become wiser, right? In regards of your enemies, what can I say? Nothing but three of swords, nothing but broken heart, nothing but pain and suffering. These individuals did not expect it. They wanted you to suffer. Now they're going to receive what they wished for you. Plus some. Clarification here. Knight of Cups, it's a new offer, like I said, coming in towards you. New offer. We also have Knight of Swords twice indication. You're going to stand up. You're going to stand up for yourself. You're ready to fight. If you suspect anybody, anybody trying to destroy your stability ever again, you're going to take actions. You're not going to be so nice. You're not going to be silent. And I mentioned that before that there is nothing wrong with being a healthy narcissist. Be a healthy narcissist. You have to have self-love in order to give your love to others. But one thing for sure, that you are not going to allow some losers to jump on your head again. Never again. I think that that experience you have experienced with these jealous lunatics and liars and sociopaths, you have had enough that will last you a lifetime. Now, this is the time for you to be happy. And you are going to stand your grounds. You are going to stand your grounds. You're going to defend what's yours. And that is in particularly, like I said, your heart. We also have six of wands, victory, victory that you will achieve because of your intellect, because of your strengths, because of your determination. You never give up. You never give up. You stand your grounds. Despite what games the lunatics played behind your back, the fakes and the liars, you stand your grounds and you're going to achieve victory. In your personal life, because you will obtain true love. In your legal disputes, if you are currently facing legal disputes. You're not a loser. Because that, that pain giving you a very powerful armor. And we have four once again. It's a stability, it's unity, it's partnership. Last card I want to pull. I just feel like I want to pull one more card in regards of your enemies here. And I will wrap up my messages. Clarification. What is this? Community. Heartbroken community. Heartbroken community here. Because these sociopaths, like I said, involved a lot of people in order to, to slander you. We have courtship. We have journey. We have occupation. We have lovers. We have mature woman. We have message of concern. This mature woman that was bribing everybody was in partnership with somebody. Like I said, part of this community. She's going to receive this message that she's pretty much done. She's going to be said, get the F out of here. It's over. Okay, death means ending and she will find out that ending. No more bribery. Nobody's going to help her anymore. She's no longer beneficial for this organization or this community. She's going to be in a severe despair. She thought she's important and special. And imprisonment. She potentially go to jail for what she did officially by official person. So if this was, like I said, a female, we did see a female, mature female that was involved with this corruption. We have seen her earlier through my readings. She could go to jail for what she did. Because there is definitely abuse of power and authority. Official abuse of power and authority. Ending and imprisonment. So, like I said, expect a wonderful changes. 
that is coming towards you. All right, my wonderful collectives. I hope you enjoyed this reading. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe. I am so happy for you. And um, hopefully see you in my next videos. Bye.